it's the time again, debate time with Brain Dead Religious People. So, this guy just, I sent him my phone number, he called me, and he wanted to provide me with evidence that Jesus is real. And I told him, no, Jesus is not real. It's fictional, allegory. History is created by those who have power. So I told him, so what kind of evidence you have that Jesus is real? Then he told me, and 30 AD, witnesses saw Jesus. And I said, oh, that's all a lie. But I can tell you that they're telling you fictional lies. So what happened in 30 AD, I asked him, what happened? What did people saw in 30 AD, 2,000 years ago? What did people saw? Jesus. I said, no. That yellow sun, that's what they saw because there was no sunlight. It's the ice age. All right? So let's read this comment. You are giving no evidence. Yes, straight nonsense. It's nonsense because you don't, your brain can't comprehend what I'm telling you. You believe in fictional Bible characters. You are brainwashed. That's why it's nonsense to all your religious people. You are brainwashed, indoctrinated. You believe in idols. Okay? History is created by those who have power. The slave masters created our history. It's all lies. To this day, it's all lies. The only ones who tell you the truth are the Native American Indians, Study Nation, Pana 3, and the Japanese. All right? So, let's keep reading. I gave you historical names outside the Bible. There's no, outside the Bible are the slave masters. They created our fake history. Islam and Israel, it's all Slave masters, okay? Israel is just a continent of fake to deceive you guys, okay? If you are a slave master and you want to control your slaves, you create a fake history so they don't run away, so they can provide you and keep doing the vegetation and everything. You lie to your slaves to keep them. You get it? So, the Bible mentioned Jesus uh, being able to perform miracles and resurrected. Now, I'm going to explain that. Jesus is the yellow sun. The miracles is he melts, the sun melts the ice away. Return of vegetation, resurrected. So let me explain that to you. Let's use the 16th chapel, then the wheel that I created. This is the 16th chapel. All right, it's telling you 10,000 years of sunlight, 2,000 years of darkness. This is your Jesus, what people saw, what people witness. Okay, you are witnesses fiction. When you remove these paintings and you start counting, there's 40 paintings. All these characters are one the same. The yellow sun. Listen, they have to tell you the truth. Fictional lies. Once you start believing in fiction, you get your creator power back. Okay? You're giving your creator power to these governments, fake religious organization. You're giving your creator power away to them, to them to control your mind. You don't do that. So here is Jesus, his resurrection, okay? Now let's remove the paintings. You see? 2,000 years of darkness, no sunlight. What happens? People live underground. Study about underground cities 2,000 years ago. So in the 30 AD, because look, no sunlight for 2,200 something years. So the fish symbol, return of the fish, plenty of fish for 10,000 years. People will be eating from nature for 10,000 years. That's the miracle. Because people will eat their children and their children, their parents. And the 2,000 years of darkness. So when you read the Bible, Noah is the yellow sun. The flood is the ice age. When you read the, when you read the Bible, the beginning, the earth, without, the earth is without form. The ice age. You look outside, all covered in ice. No, no rivers, no ocean is all covered in ice. No trees, nothing, no birds, nothing. You live underground because it's warmer. So people witnessed the return of the yellow sun. They didn't, they didn't call the sun. They didn't have a name for the sun. People didn't know what to call the sun. Because why? In the 2,000 years of darkness, lower oxygen levels. People can't think. You get it? You ain't going to get that because your brain can't comprehend what I'm saying. Low oxygen levels. People are stupid and smaller. People become geniuses again in the fire age. 
everything gets bigger again. High carbon activity makes everything bigger again. Bigger trees, oxygen in the brain. There will be no more religion on earth because people are going to see how, how stupid our civilization was believing in fictional. That's why they created the Bible. To see who the smart people are and to see who the stupid people are. Once people start waking up to reality, then the government knows that they can't brainwash their the civilization no more. They can't take advantage of them no more. You get it? So that's what the people saw. All right? It's a good movie you can watch. Logan's Run. Okay? They saw the sun for the first time and they didn't know what to call the sun. Okay? He was like, what's that? That's the sun. All right? And the girl wanted to live in the underground cities because she couldn't handle how nature was. She never saw nature. She never saw vegetation, the animals. She was freaking out. That's how all these people are going to be. Because this is a cycle. This is going to happen again. Okay? History repeats itself. And, and you, since you know nothing about the real history, you are condemned to repeat it. Because they're telling you the truth fictionalized, but you don't see... Through that, you can't see through the illusions. I'm giving you the truth right here. This is the truth. This is how the 16 chapters will look like. Not like this. You believe in the idols and the fiction. You can't see through the fiction. And I, when you call me and I told you that the Prophet Muhammad is Jesus, is the yellow sun. How many disciples Jesus has? 12. How many wives did Muhammad have? Read their book, you're going to see the same thing. Okay? You're not listening. I'm not going to listen to a guy who is lying to me. You need to listen to me. Because all historical evidence of Jesus is a lie. Okay? Israel is a lie. It's a country to brainwash the religious people like you. History is created by those who have power. So here is the truth. Okay? Age of Aquarius is the last 1,000 years of darkness. Capricorn, 1,000 years of darkness. Aquarius, 1,000 years of darkness. Capricorn, Aquarius, 2,000 years of darkness. One is like 1,000. All Bibles are philosophia mixed with science. The science they teach us in school is fake. It's a communist science. That's what I'm telling you. Everything they teach us is fake to control us, the slaves. That's why I told you to research John D. Rockefeller. I want a nation of workers. In other words, of slaves, not of thinkers. This is all worldwide except for Japan. They're the only ones to teach the truth. The Native American Indians, they're forgetting because all the lies. All right? But the old ones knew the truth. They knew about the ice wall. What is the ice wall? The 2,000 years of darkness. What is the Red Kachina? And they tell you, it's the red sun solar system becomes a blue sun. It comes in the twins. Who is the twins? Gemini, June. Who is your Judas? Who betrayed Jesus? They have to tell you the truth. Fictionalize. You don't know what fiction means. Again, go to any bookstore or the library. You will find the Bible, any Bible in the fiction aisle. You get it? So what people saw in 30 AD... Because it's 2,000 years ago, we live in number, we live in number four. One is like a thousand. 2,000 years ago in 30 AD, but that's all bullshit. All right? I call it the year one, okay? Because it's a calendar reset. In the 2,000 years of darkness, there will be a calendar reset. Then when the return of the yellow sun, another calendar reset. So what people saw coming out of the underground cities was the yellow sun. Not your imaginary Jesus. They're calling the sun Jesus. The Muslim calls the yellow sun Muhammad. Different cultures, different things, okay? It's all about the yellow sun. The yellow sun create miracles. Return of vegetation, return of wine. The fruit is wine. You get it? Revelation of Jesus Christ. You see, they're telling you the truth in the Bible, but you can't see it. Jesus is not white or black or brown or whatever. They're talking about the yellow sun moving throughout the day. So put your two fingers on my screen. Pause it. Put your two and read everything. Learn the truth. All Bibles are sun stories for smart people. You're just incredibly stupid religious person who is not listening because you've been indoctrinated, brainwashed. And that's the truth.